Greetings to you all. Today we are going to see a different study, study about uh, Jesus Christ, the Son of God. So the whole world knows who Jesus Christ is. He is the Son of God, Son of Man, God. He is called Jesus and Christ. So we will see that today. Christianity differs from all religion because it is more than a religion. It is the life of the Son of God made living in man. Christ is Christianity and Christianity is Christ. He is the supreme subject of each book of the New Testament and fulfills all the promises of God in the Old Testament from his incarnation incarnation that is a human birth to his second coming as Lord of Lords and King of Kings touching this let me read a Bible verse from the book of Revelation Revelation 17 14 they will make war on the Lamb that is Jesus the Christ who is the Lamb of God and the Lamb, Jesus the Christ, will conquer them, for he is Lord of Lords and King of Kings, and those with him are called the Chosen and Faithful. This is the book, uh, book of Revelation 17, 14 says, He is the God-man, Christ Jesus in glory exalted above all creatures having all power in heaven and on earth the bible in matthew new testament 28 18 says so and jesus came and said to them all authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me so others have been given authority only in the name of Jesus Christ. Nobody else has been given because authority is misused these days. We have seen that with open eyes. So authority is invested only in Jesus Christ, the Son of God, who is Son of Man too. During his earthly ministry, Jesus Christ claimed to be God incarnate in human flesh. He is all that he claimed to be or he is less than the least. So Revelation 1.8 in the New Testament, let's see what does it say. Jesus says, I am the Alpha and the Omega or I am the beginning and the end, says the Lord God, Jesus Christ, who is and who was and who is to come the Almighty Jesus Christ is God the Almighty the Bible says before his claim can be denied there are some things that must be accounted for other religions and fanatics and uh, those who do not believe in God rightly and those who do not know that Bible is the only word of God deny his claims they ask so many questions we have a multitude of religions especially in India every house has its own God as Kuladevam so likewise this is a satanic deception that people should not believe and accept one God who is the Lord God and King of Kings across the entire universe and that is the work of the devil soon the Lord Jesus Christ will wind up everything then only all those who are faithful to him will exist and rest all would be cannot be annihilated so they have been reserved a place along with the devil because they have given into the deception and to the great lie the devil was propagating upon the face of the earth so he will do anything to deny Christ so you please look into this Jesus Christ virgin birth let me read it again 
before his claim can be denied there are some things that must be accounted for one the virgin birth of jesus the christ and the holy and sinless life of jesus the christ then the many miracles with jesus the christ he did on the face of the earth and then his vicarious death on our behalf of the entire mankind that is no vicar for christ and the bodily resurrection of jesus the christ all these things how will you account for so the many miracles in the sense bible has not recorded all the miracles that he has done because if you have to record all the miracles that he has done the bible itself says the whole world cannot contain it so jesus the christ this is only an introduction and we will see the study uh, it's not a detailed study it is uh, under under six topic we can see the deity of jesus christ the humanity of jesus christ the virgin birth of jesus christ the death of jesus christ the resurrection of jesus christ the ascension and second coming of jesus christ these are the six topic we will see so this will be the introduction so all those who have not received jesus christ as to who he is and what he claims to be you receive him he is the only lord god he is the only way to heaven and he himself is the almighty god he is the creator of the entire universe receive him into your heart and stay blessed